to be honest, um, I really wasn't into like too much dating until I got to like high school, late middle school. So it, I was like a happy child, you know? I stayed a child for a long time. Before Miss London would dox little baby for paying her $6,000, wait, scratch that, $16,000 for a night of her services. Before Miss London would clock in 338,000 followers on Twitter and close to a quarter million on Instagram, also get nominated for an AVN award. Congrats to her for that. Before Miss London would clock in 60 million views on Pornhub and jumpstart her career on OnlyFans. At the time of this recording, the Shade Room and hip hop drama outlets, they're going wild with the expose that little baby, well, he's uh, he's got caught hanging out with Miss London in Vegas. And I got proof that he was there and that she's been working there for just a minute. Now for those of you just catching up, well she has accused him of cheating on his longtime girlfriend Jada. And uh, well we actually did a report on this over on our channel Famous News. Very emotionally scarring allegations for all parties involved. Now is there enough evidence to say yes indeed Lil Baby is guilty of cheating? I mean who knows, the internet is a crazy place. According to her Instagram bio, well Miss London she is a law student but it's unconfirmed where in fact she's studying law as of yet. Although I did find some deets in this video that actually make me think she is actually studying. Now to be honest, there wasn't a ton of info out there about Miss London, who she is, or her come up story. So I had to sit through thousands of videos with her name in the title. And after 10 trips to the bathroom, well I then found an interview on the Hotspot Lounge and they got all the deets. My parents were very strict. I have like seven brothers. Um, my dad was in the military, so I've lived some of everywhere. Um, growing up in Norfolk, well, I'm from Norfolk, but I was raised like in the beach area. So we got lots to get through in this video, but on the bright side, well, YouTube, it's actually been monetizing our videos on adult stars as of recent. So it looks like we're back in business, bringing you more each week. Nice. What's going on guys? It's your boy, Michael McCredden, talking about the life and career of Miss London, proud of fame. Here for you, of course, are before they're famous. Now as always, please hit us up with requests for who you want us to feature next. And if you're curious if Lil Baby could afford Miss London services, well, that means you haven't watched our The Rich Life video which we dropped earlier this year. We also did one on Larsa Pippen, that girl belongs to the streets. Be sure to check that out after. All right, now let's get into this video. Hey, be sure to subscribe and hit that bell. Boom! Miss London was born on December 27, 1993, making her 26 years old at the time of this recording. Now, although living on the West Coast and currently residing in Las Vegas, well, she actually hails from Norfolk, Virginia, and then she was raised in Georgia. And apparently her parents, well, they were super strict. I have seven brothers and I'm the only girl. <laughs> so um, I wasn't allowed to date, even though I still did. Um, yeah, they're just like strict, like, you know, be home at a certain time, checking my phones. I didn't even have a bedroom door. They took it off so they could see what's going on. Now, even though she's a bonafide freak today, well, back in high school, she was a little more traditional. In high school, I was with the same guy the whole time. From like, I think we started dating maybe like, I don't know, six, seven. No, I don't even know. It was so long ago, but the whole time it was the same guy. Now, she did get picked on early on in life for her curvy figure and being overly developed. So I guess that's why her parents, they had to keep the door off her room. Who knew what kind of mans were gonna try and sneak in there? Now when she was 17 or 18 years old, she finally lost her V card, and it wasn't to the first guy that she was dating for a long time, but it was someone else that she had known from her younger years. He was more like the bad boy, he got in there. Bad boy's always getting her done. Anyways, she, uh, she actually then went and did something unexpected. She went and joined the military. My plans, I think at one point I wanted to go to the military, which I did, and at one point I wanted to be a lawyer, I wanted to be a dentist, right? But to say oh, less, I did do all of these things, just about. How long were you in the military for? Um, like two, no, I want to say maybe two years, I think, two or three. As for her adult career, well, it turns out that this all happened by accident. No man that she was with, he had filmed them, and then behind her back, he uploaded online. Now from there, the damage had already been done, and everyone had already seen her in action. So she decided, what the hell, let's get to work. Video get leaked. It did it fell in your face? Like, like literally? literally did. Like, oh, God. Literally, <laughs> like, literally did. I had no idea I was going to be a porn star. Um, maybe 10 years ago, everybody has this phase in college when they're like, this shit ain't working. I got to do something else. No. So I made like a big ass list of things that I could do. And at the bottom of the list, porn star was on it. And I crossed it out. And I was like, yeah, okay. And from there, she started to love seeing herself being on set, getting all this attention, and of course, the money. From there, a star was born, and she's been in the business since at least 2017. She was also nominated for an AVN award, so congrats to her on her success. These, uh, why are you not trying to be wifey material, you know what I'm saying? Ah, 
Uh, you gotta explain it all. You can't hold it. I'm already married, guys. Oh, see? Okay, there you go. <laughs> so, hold on. How does that work when you married and do this type of stuff? Uh, it's all pretty much a mental. As long as you got the mental for it, you can do it. Then with all that done and dusted, well, let's get into a recent situation with little Baby. So we know for a fact, Miss London, she is working and living in Las Vegas. She's been there for at least five months. And we know little Baby was there as well because he was spotted partying with James Harden at a strip club. Now we also know that little Baby, he is a longtime baby mama by the name of Jada, and she appears to be there with him as well. So it all fits together. Yeah, that fits. Now to help me explain this story, I'm actually gonna have Clive, who's the host of our new channel, Famous News. Well, he's gonna break down all the details for you guys. So here you go. Thank you, Michael. Now, Miss London claimed that Lil Baby paid her $6,000 to sleep with her. According to Instagram gossip page and unofficial black TMZ, The Shade Room, Miss London made the allegations on her Twitter account. In now deleted tweets, the star made the accusations but refused to mention the rapper by name, instead naming the girlfriend Jada Cheeves. Lil Baby started dating Instagram model and entrepreneur Jada in 2016 and the pair had a child together in 2019. Adult star Miss London penned, the best D I ever had came from a millionaire who didn't say more than two full sentences to me. In another post, she wrote she would be dropping no names, but Jada was never leaving this man ever. Rapper Lil Baby quickly responded to the accusation. He said, Miss London was using his name for clout. He wrote, I get it in deleted tweets. Say baby name, get clout. Y'all need to stop the desperate shit. He added, like, huh? What the F be wrong with y'all people? When going good, watch for the devil. But following the rapper's tweets, London posted an alleged DM exchange between her and Baby. The alleged messages from Baby read, what's the point of paying if you gonna do all that? You f***ing up the game. If I pay for you ain't supposed to speak on it. That's bad business, mama. Lil Baby's girlfriend Jada also addressed the rumors. She tweeted, I'm so tired of this sh for more from Clyde, we'll be sure to check out Famous News. It's a brand new channel we've launched. We've got like 30,000 subscribers and new videos are going up daily. It's kind of like before they were famous, but micro size, so we hit all the headlines. I'm also gonna wrap up this video with two questions. Now, were some things better off left in the sheets or does Miss London belong to the streets? Let me know in the comments down below. Also, a shout out to the Hotspot Lounge. They, uh, they did the interview that had all the information to fill this thing together. So uh, I'm gonna leave a link to them down below. You can check them out. They interview a lot of adult stars. So if you're into this kind of stuff, you'll probably want to check them out. As for the rest of the story, I'm gonna wrap this one up here because this is before they are famous. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Now we drop a new video each and every day, so here's a recent drop that you might enjoy. We handpicked that one for you because if you like this video, you'll probably like that. We also got playlists like over here, so click on that if you wanna see a whole list of a bunch of videos we've dropped in the past. And if you're new to the fame gang, be sure to subscribe and turn on them post notifications, and I'll see you guys in another video. Boom!